The people of Undokwa East and West Local Government Area of Delta State are a part of Ukwani in Delta North Senatorial District. They are geographically positioned around the swampy region with numerous creeks and oil and gas explorative activities. Blessed with fertile soil and surrounded by water, most of the people are into farming and fishing. However, the absence of bridges here is creating a barrier to effective communication between neighboring communities. And to break this gap, the people have resorted to the use of pontoon to ferry their belongings across the river. This usually takes between 15 and 20 minutes. Their reliance on these means of transportation has not been felt safe, as sometimes the pontoon packs up, leaving them stranded. As this pontoon is working now, latest now, two weeks, three weeks, we will break down. How many people are dying because of this thing and they are suffering? So we don't need that again. We need the bridge here. Sometimes the engine gets blocked. That's the major problem when they stop. You know, the thing across 24 hours smoothly. That's the situation. When this happens, those who can afford it engage the services of both men. This too is not safe either. They all carry this thing for us. Our children, they pass or they go to school. Children now, what of as many children they pass for here now? Both of our side. Small, small children, they go to school. We can't die for water. You know, good now. Now, bridge, I want. Now, bridge, make them put bridge there. We need bridge here and lights. That is our own problem. In an interview with a House member representing Undokwa East constituency, he acknowledged the need for a bridge in this locality, but was quick to add that the state government was equally concerned. In as much as I know that a lot of people are agitating for bridge, I know for sure that I can tell you that in what the past government is getting, in this government today got something like that, I can tell you that my governor will try to do all he can to make sure there is a bridge there. Meanwhile, at the signing of the 2017 budget into law a few months ago, Governor Koa spoke on the need to develop riverine communities. In the past, we have to that, oh, it's very difficult to develop a riverine community where we will be. We're trying to shy away from that and to face the reality on the ground that it might cost much more to build infrastructure such as roads and bridges in swampy areas, but keeping this mandate within the reach of the people would definitely open them up to further commercial and industrial growth.